Hello everyone. Today I want to talk about the fourth house in astrology. So I was going to make it um, this video sometime later but um, I just couldn't wait because um, we are running here the horror of moon and the moon is all about the fourth house. So uh, what is the fourth house and what it represents? First of all, um, we would like to know like that the in Kalpurush Kundali, uh, Cancer is the sign that rules the fourth house. And uh, fourth house represents happiness, comfort that you gain in life. And it is the house of mother. The fourth house is basically all about the mother and the comfort that you receive from mother in throughout your life and uh, fourth house also represents the lands and buildings the fourth house represents the basic uh, early foundations of life the early childhood home is seen through the fourth house so as it represents the home and uh, the comforts in the home the childhood home and it represents the comforts from the mother. It also represents the mother figures in your life. Um, it can, your grandmothers uh, who are caring uh, for you as mothers are also can be seen from uh, the fourth house. And uh, it also represents your school teachers. And early schooling is also seen from the fourth house. And what else? Um, the fourth house uh, represents uh, vehicles, uh, it represents conveyances, um, it represents your comforts of transportation um, like the bikes, motorcycles, your cars are also seen from the fourth house. And uh, fourth house also represents your friends. Um, as uh, fourth house is uh, like as we know that uh, when uh, we are in some kind of um, um, you know distressful situation or we are little worried we the first person we reach to is uh, our friends in case our family is not available so friends are also seen from the fourth house and what else um, fourth house also it also represents your uh, your rituals, your routines in life. Um, that uh, your day-to-day -day life in uh, that you you perform the routine work that is also seen from the fourth house, and it also represents uh, like the comforts that you need at the end of the day. Like it it represents like after all the hard work because it's opposite of the tenth house like. Um, all the uh, work that you put in during the day you want to come back to your comfort zone uh, that is uh, also seen from the fourth house um, and other than that um, uh, fourth house is um, uh, as I said it is the house of like your mother uh, it can be seen um, but again it is not only the mother even the mother and father can both be seen from the fourth house. It is uh, how it works is um, because uh, in, uh, it is more about your early childhood comforts and um, um, you know. So when you're uh, when you're small, when you're very very little, um, you need comforts, and then both pa both the parents, like the father and mother, um, you know, come to provide. Um, uh, the, the, the provide the care and uh, comforts to you in life and in their own unique way. So uh, that's how it also represents your father. And there are certain things which are connected um, uh, with the ninth house that can be seen about the father through the fourth house. And I'll talk about it as well. Um, and fourth house, as I said, it's the um, it provides the foundation. Um, foundational uh, comforts and uh, foundational uh, you know um, 
things that you achieve in life. So it is also uh, the house of early education and not only that, it also um, your licensing and diplomas of your early um, college education is also seen from the fourth house. Uh, and other than that, uh, fourth house also represents um, your, um, like uh, it represents um, um, the ocean and the marine life is seen from the fourth house. It's like the uh, wells are seen from the fourth house and also the agricultural land is seen. It's the most like very important uh, thing uh, like the properties that you own, like the comforts, like the furniture in the house is seen from the fourth house as well. Um, other than that, uh, what else? Um, I would say, um, okay, so the how fourth house is connected with other houses now. Um, you know, if you see the fourth house is the um, second from the third house, so fourth, like your uh, siblings. Um, wealth that they accumulate and mostly through the family and the family values that uh, your siblings accumulate from the family uh, that is seen from the fourth house um, because uh, they have their own perception and their own experience of the family values um, so that is seen from your fourth house um, and uh, fourth house represents like from the fifth house it represents the losses uh, uh, of your children um, or the losses to you from your children can also be seen uh, from the fourth house. Uh, it also uh, represents the um, the solitude uh, of your children um, can be seen from the fourth house. And um, what else? It, uh, the fourth house also represents um, the gains through the through the debts that you incur in life. Uh, so let's say you have taken a loan um, and um, you gain any kind of interest on that amount or um, or if you invest that loan in some some area, some some kind of financial investments and then you aspire to gain out of that. So that is also seen uh, from the fourth house because it becomes the 11th house from the sixth house which is the house of your enemies, deaths, diseases. So you know that is also seen from the fourth house. So not only that, um, the gain of your enemies and uh, you know like the uh, the like uh, the gains of the gains and uh, desires of your uh, maternal uncles can also be seen from the fourth house and uh, what else we would say the fourth house from four, the fourth house also represents your um, uh, the, the power position and the career of your spouse um, it represents the uh, spiritual beliefs and uh, the religious beliefs of your in-laws, your spouse, family. Um, the fourth house represents um, it represents from the eight, uh, from the ninth house. It represents um, the um, uh, you know the the undiagnosed diseases of your father or or your gurus, uh, the undiagnosed diseases uh, of them are seen from the fourth house um, and also it uh, also like your father's uh, you know surgeries in life can also be seen in from the fourth house. Uh, also the uh, the understanding of uh, you know hidden knowledge, the occult, um, the, uh, the psychic abilities and astrology can also be seen from the fourth house as I remember when I was running uh, the Antardasha of uh, the Lord of uh, fourth house that's when um, I got pretty much uh, you know fascinated with the astrology so that can also be seen from the fourth house as I said. Um, so fourth house also represents um, the um, 
it represents the losses of uh, your elder siblings. The deaths and diseases of your el elder siblings can also be seen from the fourth house. Um, so uh, there are so many things, as I said, um, fourth house uh, represents. Um, so all in all, this is a pretty much um, brief idea about uh, the fourth house. I tried to cover as much as possible. Um, uh, so basically this is all about the fourth house and uh, uh, this represents basically the comforts uh, for yourself. It will represent the comforts and um, you know um, basic necessities which provide you the comfort and you are in your you know that uh, you know li like in a in a zone where you feel like home that's what is seen uh, from the fourth house so yeah this is uh, what i wanted to discuss about the fourth house with you guys today and i couldn't wait um and i would be coming up with the fifth house in astrology very soon till then you guys hang tight and wait for it um you have a wonderful time bye and yes I forgot to let you know that uh, tomorrow I will be going to the Princess Island Park in Calgary um, to attend the Hari Nam Sankirtan and um, you guys are also welcome to come and join.